few football teams in Memphis over the past two seasons have been as dominant as the Fairleigh Bulldogs. Coach Fred Copeland and his team are 20 and four over a two year span. His team is young, experienced and talented. Caleb Hilliard has more on why you should have Fairleigh on your high school football radar. Fairly ended last season with a record of 11 and 1, playing with a young core of players. Now the players are experienced, and after a second round exit in last season's playoffs, they look to pick up where they left off. Those kids are now propelling to take their next step past the 10 0 season. Bulldogs absolutely dominated St. George's 46 to nothing in their first game this season. <laughs> Obviously, multiple players deserve credit for the win, but 15-year-old quarterback Andrew Johnson had a game. He went 6 of 9 for over 200 yards and two touchdowns. The second-year QB earned the trust of Coach Fred Coleman last season. The sophomore now has an 11-1 record under center. Johnson says he gets a lot of support from the older players on the team. You know, they love me just like a, a brother that, that they mom made, you know, so I love them right back. It's just a family bond. Johnson's favorite target, senior wide receiver Jaquan Davis, is also lighting it up on the field. Davis was a finalist for the 2022 Tennessee Mr. Football Award, and anyone who knows football can see why. It feels good to like, just make it look easy, but the whole time just work, like paying off. Like, I've been working since I was young, since Little League. And despite a 20-4 and record through the last two seasons, Coach Copeland says his job is far from finished. There's nowhere I would rather be in the city than to be right here at 4950 Fairly Road coaching this football team. And, and I mean, our job, is, my job is not done until we march it down to Chattanooga. In Whitehaven. Energy, let's go. Energy, let's get in now. I'm Caleb Hilliard. Certainly doing a good job so far. Well, last night the Bulldogs had another dominant performance. They trampled the Kirby Cougars 48 to nothing, improving to 2 and 0 on the season. Well, good job to them. The 901 Sports Report, sponsored by T-Mobile.